Oh hi, welcome to another episode of Red Bull TV. I'm Paul. We've received a lot of emails recently asking us if the new Timberwolf pistol is related to Red Wolf. What I can say is that the Timberwolf and the Red Wolf are very different animals. A quick search of Timberwolf on the internet reveals that it can be anything from organic herbal products to tree logging equipment and even to the name of the 104th U.S. Infantry Division, as well as a Canadian C-14 sniper rifle. But what I'm here to talk to you about today is the new Timberwolf pistol from Lone Wolf Distributors, fully licensed by SOCOM Gear. Many people say that the Timberwolf looks a whole lot like one of the more popular pistols on the market today. I can't really say the name, but you can see exactly what it is. Here's the Timberwolf. Can you see the similarities? Apart from the really obvious difference in the beaver tail on the Timberwolf, you may not notice the more subtle difference, which is the angle of the grip on the Timberwolf. It's a more upright setting, which some shooters actually prefer. Since as long as I can remember, Lone Wolf Distributors has been the largest aftermarket manufacturer of slides and barrels for clocks. In late 2010, they started working on a new ergonomic frame, which they dubbed the Timberwolf. It was intended to be a drop-in replacement, offering ergonomic performance for their clocks. The noticeable improvement is in the grip design, which is much more comfortable. It also offers a different grip angle, which some people have complained on about the Glock. Another visual difference is the extended beaver tail to save people's hands from being shredded from recoil. The SOCOM Gear Timberwolf comes with an ABS lower frame and a metal slide. The magazine butt plate comes with a SOCOM Gear logo, but for those of you who want a more authentic look, you can easily switch to the included Lone Wolf logo butt plate as well. The Timberwolf frame offers some interesting features like the interchangeable grip strap to fit different hand sizes. SOCOM Gear provides two grip straps, one medium and one small, for smallish hands. Changing it out is literally a snap. The sights are stock standard with white front and rear targeting points. The trigger comes with a safety feature that prevents accidental firing. Here, you'll see the only thing not authentic on this gun, and that's in the form of the silver sliding switch on the bottom of the lower frame. Slide it backward, and the trigger is disabled. As with all SOCOM gear guns, they provide this little thread adapter that you can actually screw onto the end of the barrel, which then gives you a really handy anti-clockwise 14mm thread that you can attach a silencer to. I don't know about you, but I love the ability to attach a silencer to my pistols. It just gives it a more covert and tactical personality. Another new feature is the rounded magazine release, which is a huge improvement over the tiny one that comes standard on the Glock. It's easy to get to, comfortable to use, and it doesn't hurt your fingers. So the Timberwolf averages about 300 FPS on green gas, and that's in our testing range, which is currently at 15 degrees Celsius. The SOCOM Gear Timberwolf is 100% compatible with Tokamaruri's Model 17. The magazines are identical and interchangeable. In fact, we even put the Maruri slide onto the Timberwolf lower, and it fires just fine. What that means is that a huge market of upgrade parts and accessories designed for the Model 17 from Maruri is available and will fit this gun. So if you're looking for something old, but yet also something new, this could just be your ticket. For this product and much, much more, please visit our website at www.redmondfairsoft.com. And do subscribe to our channel today so you can stay up to date on our latest videos and newest products.